Here's how you figure out one third divided by 10. First thing I'm going to do is I'm going to take this 10 here and I'm going to consider this 10 to be 10 over one because 10 divided by one, it's still 10, but now things line up kind of nice. Next, I'm going to take the reciprocal of 10 over one. So we're going to take the numerator, move it down here and the denominator goes up top. That way I can take my one third and instead of division, I'm going to do multiplication by the reciprocal. So 10 on the bottom, one on the top. So that's one tenth. With fractions, when you multiply, it's a little bit easier because one times one equals one. And then we multiply the denominators. Three times 10 is 30. So one third divided by 10 or one third times one tenth, that gives us one thirtieth. And that makes sense because we have one third. We're trying to see how many times this whole number 10 fits into one third. One third is less than one. So our answer has to be less than one, should be less than one third as well, which it is. This is Dr. B taking one third divided by 10. Thank you for watching.